Hi, I'm Brooke from Valley View Nursery in Ashland, Oregon. I'm going to be planting a really simple indoor planter today. And we're going to start with some potting soil. I like to use Master Pride's potting soil from Master Nursery. That's one we have really good success with. Putting about two inches in the bottom of my planter. Then I'm going to put some plant food in. I like to use bumper crop, rose and flower. I put a little bit in and then I plant my plant so that it's right by the roots and it just gives it a little extra boost. I'm going to be using shamrock plant here. It is called charmed wine. How cute is that? I'm going to put that to the back. Then I'm going to have to put more soil in because my next little plants are much smaller. They are just two inch size pots. So I have to get a lot more soil in here to get them up to the right height. I'm going to use two purple wandering juice and to get your plant out if it's a little tight and it doesn't want to come out, give it a little tap, tap, tap. That's all you have to do. And then it comes right out just how you want it to be. These plants, you don't want to tug on them. They're pretty, um, the roots are pretty tender, so you want to be careful with what you're doing. You're not giving them too much yanking around, and you certainly don't want to pull on the crown. If you pull on the crown, which is right where it connects to the soil, you're going to end up breaking your plant. This is called a club moss. These are all house plants, but they can be outside in the summer, out on your patio, in part sun to part shade. A little messy. You can kind of reposition the way you want it to be as you're planting. You put a little bit more plant food in here. I use uh, about a quarter cup to a half cup in this size planter. You want to make sure you tuck it in all the way around. You don't want any holes. You want to make sure the roots are all the way covered back here all the way around and there you are the wandering jew is going to hang down this is going to pop super simple this one's going to run you because of the planter this one's going to run you about forty dollars while this one in your terracotta planter is going to run you about 25 so the planters make a difference but both are really pretty whatever you choose right here valley view nursery ashland oregon